If you look at Steve Jobs, and Oprah, Eminem and Kanye West and all above, they are weird because they have seen things no one else seen for their career path. You thinking about quitting? You thinking about giving up? This is for you. I want everybody to listen to those words in this video. Do not let much time go by without making some decisions. The ones that you can make quickly, make them quickly. The ones that take time, take your time. Don't let any decision to be an enemy. Rob you of your future, empty your bank account. Don't let this happen. I'm gonna fight for my family. I'm gonna fight for my life. I'm gonna fight to be a man. I'm gonna fight to be a good father. I'm gonna fight to be a good mother. Hear me out. Some of you are thinking of giving up. Some of you are thinking of quitting. Some of you will say, it's already done for me. It's over. You gotta stop tripping. You gotta stop. Ain't over for you. Ain't never over for you. You need to change your mind. You seen that just because you're in season of failure. Just because you fail doesn't mean that God doesn't have a bright future for you. I don't want to know how to make it work. I want to know why it doesn't work. You gotta look for why. You gotta find out why. Because if your why is strong, how gonna be easy. And the only way to find out why it doesn't work is by failure. See, I'm telling you right now, failure is the best teacher you can ever have. Failure will take care of you and your problems. Failure will make you learn from mistakes that you made. You can't manage time. Everybody gets 24 hours a day. What's the most important is managing yourself, what you do with your time. Don't go through life trying to please everybody. If you try to keep every person around you happy, the only person that won't be happy is you. If you're wondering, can I keep going? Can I keep moving? Can I carry on? Can I do this? Can I do that? Absolutely, you can. If you're wondering, can I trust myself? You have no choice. You might look at everybody in the world right now. Look at their stories. But do you have any idea how they get there? Let no man or no woman to put you down or put you under. You must become strong. You must become something unique. You must prepare yourself for the next battle. And remember, every battle makes you smarter and stronger. And a person with big experience. Yes, every battle cannot be won 
but the winning attitude to not give up it's more important it's good enough to carry on and this is what makes you unique this is what makes you something not around this is what makes you special this is what makes you stronger this is what makes you standing on your feet just because you feel you wanna quit just because somebody didn't like you today and didn't love you tomorrow you wanna quit you wanna give up on your life and your life is yours I don't understand why just explain to me why you want to give up on your life and your life is yours it doesn't belong to anybody else but you all what you did was look down all what you thought about was sorrow all what you thought about was a misery you never give yourself a chance to look up you gotta give yourself a chance. You gotta start looking up. You gotta start climbing that mountain. Cause you know what? You will find your dream become a reality when you get there. For every opportunity that you got, you gotta be willing to work a little bit harder and go after it. That's when you gotta get a little bit deeper. That's when you gotta go after it a little bit harder than you have ever done in your life. You will be grateful. Cause what God's doing in you, it's more important than what you're going through. It's necessary. You are in the process. God processing you. You just gotta quit dripping during the process. I like A and Z. I'm not a big fan of the middle. I like the beginning and the end. And God says, if you trust me all the way through, I will get you from A to Z. God, you should know something about God, first of all. God promised you. God promised all of us, but I'm talking to you. God promised you to get you there, but he didn't say how. So what you gotta do is keep your faith, keep believing, keep trusting in God. That's the only thing you gotta do. You think you are ready, but you are not, because God's still preparing you for the next step of your life. God's still working on you for the next level of your destiny. You think you are ready, but you're really not. Put your trust on God. Lean on God. Pray for God. Thank God. Just think about it. I mean, just think about it. Why you are here in the first place and why you are still 
here. As long as he wakes you up, that means he is done with you. He got plan for you. He got plan for your life and season that you are in. So keep your faith and keep believing what you believe in. No matter how big your problems are, if you can spend some time praying to God, He will help you fix your problems. So what you think, huh? You think that too much for God? Remember, God made you. God made those problems. And he can fix you and fix those problems. You just gotta put your trust on God. You just gotta believe that he is walking with you everywhere, step by step. And he will take care of you no matter how. Some way, somehow, he gonna take care of you and your problems. Trust me, no one, nobody, no person, no money will do you like God will. And God is on your side. Remember that.